Welcome to 3D Printiverse. I had received my order of various printing plates from Wham Bam in January 21st. Today, after much printing has been done, I will compare if the plates from AliExpress are as good or better than the original from Wham Bam. Let's look in the package what is all in it. I have ordered plates for my Ender 3 and my Eligu Mars. Today we will take a closer look at the plate for the Eligu Mars. If anyone would like to see a video on the Wham Bam Flex plate for the Creality Ender 3, please post it below in the comments. In case you haven't done it yet, please like the video, leave a comment, let us know what you want to see next, and don't forget to click the bell icon and subscribe to the channel to not miss any new videos. Thank you. Okie dokie, a wham bam sticker. I like it, I need just a place to stick it on. This is the one for the Ender 3. Not for today's video. Let me know in the comments if you want to see it in action. Let's see what's all for the Eligu Mars is in the package. The print plates, looks good. The magnet holds the plate strongly. It's now time to compare the two plates, from AliExpress and Wham Bam. If you not have seen the video about the AliExpress Flex Plate, then click on the info card or you'll find the link in the video description below. I will print the same 3D model as last time, so we have a comparison.
look so far so good. Let's see how it pops from the plate. Let's take a look at the differences between the two plates. There is a difference in their thickness, about 0.1 millimeters. So, what are the differences, and which of the plates is better than the other? The pros for the Wham Bam plate is, it's more flexible than the AliExpress one. The prints after bending the plate, pops better from print plate without. After using a few weeks, the quality and reliable is still the same. The strong magnet holds heavy prints without problem. The energetic 3D plate from AliExpress is not so much flexible than Wham Bam plate. Because that the prints pops not so easy but, it's reliable too and the strong magnet for heavy prints do his job pretty well. So, what is the summary of this comparison? Well, the plate from AliExpress does its job very well, and is a good alternative in terms of price and reliability. The original Wham Bam has a better bendability of the plate and this makes it easier to remove the objects from the print bed. For those who often print many objects and want a better and faster handling should take the original Wham Bam because the price is not much higher than the copies of AliExpress. The links to the products can be found as always below in the video description and leave a comment about what you think of the print plates. And don't forget to click the bell icon and subscribe to the channel to not miss any new videos. Thank you.